course, you are more than welcome to stay for the installation video of uh, the, this air horn. Other than that, thank you for stopping by. Arrivederci! <laughs> okay, boys and girls, let's do some fun stuff. We're gonna be installing Volo Air Horde Model 440 that plays iconic melody from the Godfather movie. I decided not to drill any holes in the body of my car and instead use existing mounting points that happen to be on top of my oil cooler. So I grabbed a 19 inch U channel out of galvanized steel where I drilled holes 3 inches apart and treated it with the rust preventer. After everything dries up you are ready to mount your horns, put the bolt in the base of your air horn, uh, secure it with a leveling plastic spacer and mount it onto your bar using security lug nut that's provided in the kit. Next we're gonna be moving to our air compressor. On the bottom of that compressor you're gonna have to splice and attach wires uh, to proper terminals. You are now ready to start hanging stuff. So to hang air compressor, easy peasy, put the bolt through, rubber gasket, find your mounting point and secure it with the lug nut and the washer. I have enough space on the side of my oil cooler and that's where I decide to mount my air compressor. Keep in mind it has to be mounted vertically and that's why you wire it before you hang it so it's just easier uh, in the long run. Let's place our air horns, uh, see how our design is playing out. Just hand tighten those, you know, check for fitment, make sure you know it doesn't rub or anything. And now we are ready to wire the whole thing up. I decided to connect to my factory horn button and that's why positive terminal from the air compressor is left under the hood. Negative terminal is connected to factory horn negative uh, wire and extended back under the hood. Uh, positive terminal from your horn button is connected to a 20 amp fusible link which is split at the end and connected to the left side and the bottom side of the relay leaving number 87 on top and number 85 exposed and that's where you're going to be connecting those wires that are presently under the hood so pass you really back under and you are ready to connect connect your plus wire from the air compressor to number 87 on the relay and the last hunk wire uh, to number 85 on that relay don't forget to mount it and you are ready to move on to air tubes installation. Measure, cut and bend your airlines, uh, connect them by color, create your own beautiful artwork, do not look at mine. Uh, this is actually a testing installation so before you tighten everything up, test, make sure it works then you're pretty much gonna clean up your work tighten all the nuts and bolts and you are ready to start hunking around and that's what i'm gonna start doing now i hope i shed some light on the installation of the air horn um, see you guys next time arrivederci <laughs>